Hey YouTubers, Steven here. Okay, uh, happy homebrew Wednesday everybody. Um, that seems to be when my, my uh, home brewing tips in under five minutes is coming out, so I actually have a good one for you here. Uh, quick, simple and easy. Um, I was transferring my um, experimental beer. I almost said the name. Oops. Anyways, I was transferring it to bottle the other day. And when I come downstairs, this has never happened to me before. But guess what? My racking line was full of sediment, yeast, all from the bottom of the fermenting bucket. I was upset. <laughs> it was, mm. Should have taken a picture of it, but I didn't. And of course, I didn't find one online. So today's brewing tip in under five minutes. If you think that you've sucked up sediment uh, into your beer and you want your beer to be nice and clear, don't fret. Grab a glass carboy if you have one or another fermenting bucket. doesn't really matter. I grabbed a, a carboy, cleaned it real quick. I still had my sanitizer out, so I sanitized it. I just transferred everything into the glass carboy. Within two days, it was totally settled out. Let me show you. So here we go. Here's my experimental beer, and you can see the amount of crap on the bottom of it. Beautiful color, eh? Hint, hint, everybody. This is the experimental beer. And that's just two batches of uh, wine cooler wash that um, are ready to get potassium sorbate. Um, it, it's a pretty easy tip. Uh, you know, don't fret. It's not going to hurt anything if you throw it in you know, a glass carboy or another bucket for a couple of days uh, to settle out. Uh, and your beer will come out much better because of it. Um, I was thinking about doing a secondary anyways for this beer, so maybe it was just fate. Who knows? But uh, thanks for watching, everybody. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do. Uh, and I enjoy reading your comments and your emails. If there's anything you'd like to see, drop me a line. See what I can do to help you out. So uh, until next time, happy brewing, everybody.